Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Review since 10.32 a.m. That's Sunday, July 21st, 2024. My eyes, my eyes are a little bit red, but I barely got any sleep last night. Um, I shouldn't have ate, like, around, almost, like, after 9 p.m., you know? I ate, like, a buffalo chicken sandwich from Arby's and some of the potato cakes. And then I had, like, um, some of the new 7-Eleven exclusive Cherry Slurpee Twinkies. Um, because, yeah, as you yesterday, I went to Oklahoma City. Well, Norman, which is, like, close to Oklahoma City. That's where, like, the closest 7-Eleven is near to me. Um, but I got some drinks to review, but, um, anyway. This I um, got a few days ago. I got this at GNC. They also should have this at the Vitamin Shop. And, um, this is not an exclusive flavor, so you can get this at, like, some other places. Um, this is a brand new flavor of the Gorilla Mine Energy Drinks. I was wanting to review this for, on the 4th of July, but, um... My car's ignition was messed up, so I couldn't, like, drive anywhere. Um, so now I finally got it, so now I'm going to be reviewing it today. Um, very patriotic can, very red, white, and blue, very USA, but um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the new Bomb Sickle Gorilla Mind Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, 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 oh yeah. Very red, white, and blue, you know, just saying. So, oh yeah. It has a black top um, lid and it has a black tab. Bomb's the Best Buy Name Production Code. Best Buy May 29th, 2025, so it's still fresh for a while. It has a plastic label on the can with a smooth texture. So just getting out of my refrigerator, it's a little bit slippery. It has the Gorilla Mine logo. Gorilla Mine Bomb Sickle Energy Drink. And it shows the Bomb Pops or the Rocket Pops. The red, white, and blue popsicles. And the design of the label looks like it's like melted paint or something. It's like dripping, you know, or like in the melted popsicle. It's like dripping on the different colors. Different like gradients of colors. It's like darker blue and lighter blue. Oh no, and there's like white speckles in the red. Really cool looking label design. Very unique. It's probably the most unique of the Gorilla Mind Energy Drink cans. This one's really cool looking. I like the look of it. Um, so yeah. Zero sugar per can, 16 fluid ounces, 473 milliliters. Bomb sickle energy drink. No sugar artificial colors, unmatched energy, amplified focus, enhanced concentration, increased productivity, elevated mental clarity. Shows like um, some sugar cubes with a crossover, a lightning bolt, an arrow and a target, a brain, a gear with an arrow in it, and like a light bulb in a person's head. Has like some nootropic stuff, um, because that's why it's called Gorilla Mind, you know, because it's also for your mind. It shows like his brain, you know. But yeah, 1000 milligrams in nice tall tyrosine, 400 milligrams alpha GPC 50%, 200 milligrams caffeine, 200 milligrams uridine monophosphate, 100 milligrams L theanine, 15 milligrams saffron extract, 200 micrograms super ZNA, 100% five essential vitamins. Has this key and some other code. The warning caution this part is not intended for healthy adults 18 years of age or older. Non consuming for your sense of caffeine or in combination with caffeine or stimulants from other sources. Too much caffeine may cause nervousness, durability, sleeplessness, occasion of rapid heart rate. Not for use by women who are pregnant nursing and trying to become pregnant. Sold to a licensed qualified healthcare professional before consuming this product. Not use if you're taking a prescription drug or have a medical condition. Not see two cans per day. Um, but yeah, my vitamin shop was out of this flavor, but they have it though. But on my GNC, I had a little bit. Luckily, they had a few cans left. So I got like two cans of it. They still had some more though, but um, I should have got more than two cans because, um, spoiler warning, I already had one of these and it was pretty lit, you know, just saying. But yeah, nutrition facts are so one can, 16 foot ounces, the numbers are in calories 10. Total fat, 0 grams, 0%, 225 milligrams, 1%. Total carbohydrates, 0 grams, 0%, total sugar, 0 grams. Includes 0 grams added sugar, 0%. Protein, 0 grams. Yeah, it's like $3.49, so the same price at GNC as the Gorilla Mines are at the Vitamin Shop. It's a little bit expensive. Almost $4 for one can, you know, with tax. Um, but yeah, their ingredients, carbonated filtered water, natural flavors. Citric acid, and acetyl alterose, and alpha-GPC 50%. Sucralose, caffeine, and hydrocyridine, five monophosphate, sodium benzoate reserve, potassium sorbate reserve, L-theanine, and zorbic acid, isofane potassium, niacinamide, saffron extract, editate calcium disodium, calcium pentothenate, Paradoxal 5 phosphate, methacobalamin, and hoperzine A. I forgot to read the other part of the nutrition box.
Vitamin C, 90 milligrams, 100%. Niacin, 16 milligrams, 100%. Vitamin B6 says P5, P5 milligrams, 290%. Vitamin B12, 5 micrograms, 210%. Panathenic acid, 5 milligrams, 100%. That's the Gorilla Mine Energy Matrix. Mount Burkan is their energy blend. And A style Alterosin, 1000 milligrams. Alpha GPC, 50%. 40, I mean, sorry, 400 milligrams. Caffeine, 200 milligrams. Uridine, 5 monophosphate, 200 milligrams. Ophiane, 100 milligrams. Saffron oxide, 15 milligrams. Cuprazine A, 200 micrograms. Manufactured exclusively for Gorilla Mine Beverage Incorporated, 7154 West State Street, Suite 138, Boise, Idaho, 83714. USA support at GorillaMine.com. Phone number is plus 1-833-GRLAMND. Please recycle has a recycling logo, the X logo, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube logos. GorillaMine.com. This statement has not been avowed by the FDA as long to diagnose, treat, or any diseases. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can, so I'll let you see it right quick. Just woke up uh, like less than an hour ago. I barely got any sleep, so I'm sorry if I sound a little bit messed up. Try not to mess up talking too much. But also, my brother gets off in like 20 minutes, so I might have to go get him. They said his friend Dylan might be picking him up today. My brother hasn't messaged me yet, saying if he is or not. So I might have to leave soon. There's the SKU. The warning. Now for the nutrition facts. This drink is already like starting to not get too cold. Um, my ice box wasn't working right now, so I've been having to use like an ice chest. I don't want to put this in the ice chest because um, the water might mess up the label, you know, and I needed it for my Instagram photos, you know, um, in best condition, you know. Um, so I put it in my ice box. It's still working a little bit in like the crisper part of it, but um, it doesn't get too cold, but it's got a little cold, see what I mean? Um, but it was like still pretty cold when I brought it out here, but now it's like starting to get warm though. But um, anyway, that's pretty much the entire can, but um, anyway, now I'm going to show it off up closer quick, so hold on a minute. The Bomb Sickle Gorilla Mind Energy Drink. Really cool looking can. I like the red, the white, and the blue gradient color pattern. Looks pretty cool. This one has, I think, the most unique design of a Gorilla Mind Energy Drink. You have a black top, black tab. On the Best Buddy and Production Code. May 29th, 2025, so it's still fresh for a while. It's in a labeled can. Shows the bomb pops or the rocket pops. Has like a melted like paint sort of look. There's like different like dark splashes like inside the lighter splashes. Yeah, it looks like it's been like painted or something. Looks pretty cool. Two hundred milligrams caffeine. Some nootropic stuff, SKU, other codes, the warning. Now for the nutrition packs. Other ingredients. The distributor information, the Gorilla Mind Energy Matrix, which is like their energy blend, and the rest of the can. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. And right, I'm gonna finish my review for it, so hold on. Now. Okay, I shot off the can up close, and I'm gonna shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Probably got less than like three hours of sleep last night. Yeah, I shouldn't have ate too close to my bedtime, because I ate, like, around 9 p.m., but, um, I didn't go to bed, so, like, almost 1, it was, like, around 12.30-something, but, um, I don't have that problem, though, but, yeah, there's no artificial color, so the color's clear, it's a little bit carbonated, it's a little bit hard to tell, because it's a black top, um, but, yeah, it's clear, anyway, the scent, 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yep, definitely smells like a red, white, and blue popsicle. It smells very similar to the, um, the Rocket Pop Alani New Energy Drink, or the Rocket Pop, um, like the Adrenaline Shock Accelerator. A little bit like the Frozen Bombsicle C4, or like, um, uh, yeah, the other, um, red, white, and blue one, I think it was called, like, Freedom Frost C4. And, um... Yep, just smells like some of the other red, white, and blue popsicle drinks that I've had before, but, um, probably smells the closest to the Adrenaline Shock Accelerator. Um, yep. Definitely like a nice juicy, like, cherry, blue, raspberry, citrusy scent. Um, definitely smell the cherry. Definitely the cherry stands out maybe the most, though. Um, smell the blue raspberry in there a little bit. And smell the citrus in there a little bit, but I mostly smell the cherry though. But it still smells pretty good, but anyway, now I'm going to try it, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Yep, and this probably tastes the closest to the Adrenaline Shock Accelerator Rocket Pop. So if you had that one, this one tastes pretty much just like that. Has that same fresh, juicy type of flavor um, compared to the C4. The C4 is like, even though you know it's still like a liquid, it doesn't feel as juicy as like the um, the Adrenaline Shock did. And also this though, um, the C4 had more of like an artificial, like a little bit of like a drier type of taste. But um, the Adrenaline Shock and this Gorilla Mine, they're definitely more of like a fresher, juicier type of taste, even though it doesn't have any juice in it. A little bit hard to explain, you know, but, um, maybe a teeny bit syrupy, but, um, still really tasty, though, really good. Definitely a good mix of flavors, definitely tastes the cherry the most. I taste the blue raspberry and maybe the, um, the, um, I think it's, like, lime or lemon. I think it's lemon. Uh, well, some white popsicles are supposed to be, like, lemon, but, um, some white popsicles, are, I think, are, like, um, grapefruit, but, um, I think it's supposed to be lemon, though, but, um, I think I, the lemon and the blue raspberry stands out about the same, but, um, the, yeah, the cherry stands out the most, though. Probably say, like, um, 70% cherry, maybe 30%, like, blue raspberry and, like, the lime, or whatever, the lemon, um, stand, those stand out about the same though, but, um, yeah, I can barely taste those though. The cherry definitely stands out the most, but still really good though. Tastes good. Very sweet, a little tart. Not too carbonated, so you can probably check it if you want to. Energy wise will definitely give you pretty less 200 milligrams caffeine, high high in the B vitamins and stuff. Also has some nootropic stuff, so it can help you with your focus and stuff. Make you more alert. So say energy wise, last about four and a half hours, about six hours of energy. We work a little bit more. So, oh yeah, boys, it'll still definitely give you pretty lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Has a really cool, um, unique can design. Definitely like the melted type of look to it. Where it's like dripping on the other colors. Definitely uh, the most unique Gorilla Mine can. Very cool looking. Um, energy wise, it works pretty good. It's not an exclusive flavor, so you can also find it at the Vitamin Shop. But I got a GNC though. Um, it's the same price at the vitamin shop though, but I'm um, still a little bit expensive, almost four dollars for one can at both places. So probably if you order them on the Grill Martin website, that's probably the best deal, you know. Get um the cans a little bit cheaper, but um you might have to pay for shipping though. But if you order more than one case, you may get free shipping, see so you know what I mean? Not for sure though, but um yeah, it tastes good, Orange Wars works good, it has a cool can design, definitely highly recommend it. This one tastes basically just the same as the Adrenaline Shock Accelerator Rocket Pop. That one's my favorite Rocket Pop energy drink, so this one tastes just like that. Except in, in, in like a bigger can, but, um, with a, about the same amount of caffeine though. But uh, with more nootropic stuff in it too though. So yeah, really good, definitely highly recommend it. Might be one of my favorite Gorilla Mine flavors, I don't know though. Still definitely like the strawberry candy one and the um, orange rush one. And um, yeah, the tropical blast one or whatever it was, tropical burst. Um, this one's still really good though, definitely highly recommend it. I'm going to give the new Bombsicle Gorilla Mind Energy Drink. 
You know what, boys? You know what? I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh, yeah, boys. It's lit. So, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh, yeah. Definitely highly recommend it. Really good. Very tasty. Bomb pop flavor. Um, Energy Wise Works got his cool can design. Definitely highly recommend it. It could be a little bit cheaper, but still really good, though. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Anyway, my next energy drink review video will be the new root beer, Bum Energy Drinks. So Stay tuned for that review. But on my next video that I'm going to be uploading today is going to be the new 7-Eleven exclusive Mountain Dew Infinite Swirl Soda. I just got that last night. So I'm going to be reviewing it today. Stay tuned for that review too. But um, anyway, so my upcoming video. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.